what is up guys welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video in this video we're going to be doing up some nachos when you think pit boss when you think pellet smokers the only thing you're thinking of is what kind of meat am i going to smoke don't keep yourself to one item there is many things you can smoke on this pit boss and many things when you're not feeling it when you don't feel like going outside you don't feel like cooking at all make it easy and quick utilize this thing i'm telling you it'll make your life 110 percent better we're going to be smoking up on the pit boss some chili and cheese nachos that's it you're going to have your hormel chili you're going to have your rico's nacho cheese or whatever kind of nacho cheese you want and you're going to have tostito chips layer it in the pan get it done and get it prepped the prep time is nothing you got like two or three minutes it's that easy also, what's optional is gonna be your shredded cheese. Use the shredded cheese of your choice, sprinkle a little bit on top, get that bad boy ready. 375 in the smoker, you ready to go. Don't forget, if you like this video, subscribe down below to the channel, smash that thumbs up button, and don't forget that little bell icon, smash it so you can get all my latest and greatest videos. With that being said, if you guys are ready to get smoking, I am not gonna do it for you. Let's get it. All right, guys, we got 30 minutes to game time. We want a simple, easy, quick recipe. Go outside to your pellet smoker, preheat it to 375 degrees. Then we're going to come back in. We're going to do the hardest part of this video. Pop open your can of nacho cheese and then your can of chili. Your choice with whatever you want. Dump it in a bowl. Mix it thoroughly together. Then you're going to go ahead and you're going to lay out your Tostitos on a throwaway pan and dump it and spread your sauce evenly over top of it and your optional step is if you want to sprinkle shredded cheese on top which i do but that is totally up to you this is a total of five minute prep time don't forget down below in the description box you'll have a list of step by step instructions on what to do that simple Now that you have completed your chili and cheese nachos, it is time to put them into the smoker. The smoker is already preheated to 375 degrees. You are going to monitor this closely, 12 to 15 minutes as soon as the cheese melts. We want this off because we do not want our nachos to be soggy. We want them to have a nice snap to them. Well, guys, that's going to go ahead and wrap up yet another video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And this has been a presentation of chili and cheese smoked nachos. It's simple. This isn't a video that me and my wife planned out. We were home. It was dreary outside. We were getting hungry. You don't need meats to smoke on your pit boss all the time. You can go outside the box. You can smoke pretty much anything you want on this thing. That is the beauty of it. We go in, we check the cabinets, we find a bag of chips, we go in, we check another cabinet, then all of a sudden, we got cheese sauce, then all of a sudden, we got chili. It's that easy. It's great. You can't beat it. Two minutes to prep it up, 15 minutes on 350, 375 on the pit balls, done. You guys are eating in no time. Sit down, park your behind, watch your favorite game, you do what you do. With that being said, go down below, subscribe to my channel. Smash that thumbs up button. Do not forget to hit that little bell icon so you can see all my latest and greatest videos. And I will see you fine, ladies and gentlemen, at the next video. See ya.